Hi guys, welcome to Life Science Job Channel. So, CSIR, National Botanical Research Institute at Lucknow is conducting a walk-in interview for different positions and for many project associate roles. So, before seeing educational qualification, let's see first the date of interview. So, for area 1 will be 21st October 2024, 11am, that is tomorrow. I'm extremely sorry guys for posting it late. Just now I got this PDF. So I am posting this video because they have given the interview date from 21 to 25. Even 21 is tomorrow for area 1. You can also attend some other areas for interview too. So they have given for area 1 interview date is 21 October 2024, 11am and 23rd October 2024 for area 2 and for area 3, 24th October and for area 4, 25th October and for area 5, 25th October at 3pm. So the location will be KN Kaul Block CSIR NBRI at Lucknow. So now we will see the educational qualification required for. So for area 1 for molecular biology and biotechnology department. So for the first serial number for they are hiring for the role of project associate and you must have an educational qualification of MSc in botany, biotechnology or MSc in two years of R&D experience. So for this freshers can't apply. So we'll see which applicable is for freshers. So serial number three for the role of project associate, you must have an educational qualification of MSc in botany, plant sciences, life sciences, biotechnology, biochemistry, plant molecular biology. So this is the educational qualification and desirable qualification is experience in plant molecular biology techniques and genomics. So if you have a MSc itself in botany, plant sciences, life sciences, you can get hired still. But if you have experience in plant molecular biology techniques and genomics, there will be an added advantage. You will be given preference. So for this, you must not be more than 35 years and the salary will be 25,000 per month for the project exploring Bresinosteroid mediated mechanism of plant growth and adaptation under elevated CO2 conditions. So your interview questions will be based on your title of the project. So kindly note your title of the project and the position you are applying for. Your interview questions will be based on that only. So that's all for freshers for area 1. And for area 2, for this interview will be on 23rd October. Let's see for freshers for area 2 serial number 2. For the role of project associate, the hiring for candidates who are having educational qualification in MSc in Botany, Chemistry, Biochemistry, Biotechnology, Microbiology, Bioinformatics or M Pharma. So that's it. So some knowledge of secondary metabolites in medicinal plants will be a desirable qualification. You will be given preference if you are having some knowledge in this. That's it. So the maximum years must be 35. And for this, they are giving a salary for 31,000 if you are qualified NET or GATE or other central government exam and 25,000 who are not qualified for that exam. So the project title will be Biotechnological Interventions for Management of Protected Areas. So your interview question will be based on that only. So serial number 3, they are hiring for the role of project associate and you must have an MSc in Chemistry, Polymer Chemistry, Pharmaceutical Chemistry, Medicinal Chemistry, Analytical Chemistry or Biochemistry. So desirable experiences, some knowledge and experience of extraction and isolation processes, characterization, formulations and handlings of instruments. So you will be given pre preference if you have this and the maximum age must be 35 years old and the salary will be 31,000 if you are qualified for net or gate and 25,000 if not. So the project title is sustainable packaging solutions for net zero future. So your interview question will be based on this title only and for area three. <coughs> for the department of plant ecology and environment technologies so for serial number two they are hiring for the role of project associate and you must have an msc in botany plant science environmental science plant ecology biochemistry forestry or biotechnology so that's it for this you must be maximum years of 35 years old and for this they are asking some desirable knowledge in ecological sampling methods and niche modeling and quantification of various ecosystem services so, and some experience in plant tissue culture technique. So you can attend the interview if you are a fresher for this role also. And for this they are giving 31,000 who have qualified net or gate and 25,000 who, who are not qualified. 
so for this they are given the title project title biotechnological interventions for management of protected areas so the same and for area 4 serial number 2 they are hiring for the role of project associate and you must have an msc in botany plant sciences life sciences and desirable is some experience in field work extension activities good communication and computer skills so for this you will be paid 25000 per month and the project title is integrated aromatic flora village for livelihood enhancement so for area 5 let's see for freshers for serial number 2 they are hiring for msc in botany chemistry biochemistry genetics plant breeding or msc in genetics and plant breeding genetics and agriculture so for this you must have some experience in plant breeding and handling of hplc analysis of metabolite basic knowledge of statistical data analysis even freshers can apply for this too and the stipend will be 25000 per month and the title of the project will be development of low thc fiber line in cannabis through requirement selection based breeding strategy for industrial purposes so your interview question will be based on that only so serial number three they are hiring for scientific assistant or administrative field assistant for this you can have a graduate or diploma in any discipline so preference will be given to candidates with experience in experiment fill lab management scientific or administrative work for this the salary will be 15000 so as i have said earlier the date and venue of interview the date for area 1 is 21st october 2024 and 23rd october for area 2 and 24th october for area 3 and 25th october 11 am for area 4 and 25th october 3 pm for area 5 so for this they have given some terms and conditions too so the application form will be provided at the venue however candidates may also download the application form in advance if you want so they will also provide the application form at the venue or if you want you can also print the application form in advance too so i'll put the link of the application form and this pdf in description so kindly check description for application form and this pdf and and the time of interview you should bring at least one photograph and original documents of your educational qualifications and other certificates and certificate indicating date of birth and experience certificate so result awaited candidates will not be considered and every candidates must be present at least one hour before the scheduled time for necessary document verification so kindly be one hour prior to the interview so if there are large number of candidates are present you will be given written test also or and then followed by an interview so candidates applying for project number gap 35259 must be a resident of uttar pradesh so let's see what's that so for just for area 3 for serial number 1 junior research assistant if you are applying for this you must be a resident of Uttar Pradesh only for this job opportunity other than this for any role you can be from any part of India so the relaxation and age limit for candidates belonging to the category of SC, ST and women in the category of OBC shall be 5 years and 3 years respectively so this is the application form for recruitment and project you must stick your passport size photo here and you have to mention the name of the project and area applied for and name of the post and name of the candidate your father name or husband name your date of birth and your age as on interview date permanent address and again your address email phone number and you have to mention your category and do you have any blood relative at NBRI or CSIR you have to mention if you have and you have to fill your educational qualification details you must mention the name of the board or university you studied and the examination year of passing subject parks or percentage in case of cgpa you must convert it into percentage and you have to mention have you qualified for csir or ugc net examination if yes you have to write that and your work experience if you have if you're a fresher you can just leave this so you have to mention have you worked in any csir lab or institute 
so you have to mention this also even for internship you should mention this and finally you have to sign it and the date will be should be your interview date so that's it guys if you like this video please do like share subscribe to my channel guys thank you